Hey guys, it's I Hello Otaku, and today I received some packages in the mail, and I figure I'd do an unboxing video for you, and this would be an, a mystery unboxing. I don't know what they are, and I figure that'll be more fun if you don't know what they are as well. Um, makes it more, uh, you know, suspenseful. Uh, I'm hoping that it is the package that I'm waiting for, and let's find out if it is. Alright, so I've opened it here and it looks like it is the package that I've been waiting for. This is a Pokemon volume that I ordered for about like a month now. I was getting a little worried because I didn't know if it would, might be lost in the mail or anything like that. I've never had that happen, but you know, you never know. This is Pokemon Johto League Champion Volume 5. Um, now I still got a long way to go because I've only have two volumes from this season and I think there's seven volumes in total. I'm not too sure, I have to double check, but yeah, still got a long way to go. Simple packaging, seven episodes, nothing too special. Let's take a look at the second um, package. Alright again, so I pre open it and let's see what they are, or what it is. Alright, so I think I kind of have an idea of what it is. Yep, it is Last Exile. Now, um, I decided to buy this because I noticed on Right Stuff is it's, it's out of print now. They don't have it in stock anymore. Um, the new edition, which is the classic um, release, is replacing this old one. So yeah, I decided to buy the thin pack release because, you know, I think it's just, it looks nicer. And, you know, it has more artwork this way. I prefer, you know, thin pack over just the standard DVD case or the the classic collection that Funimation's been releasing. I don't know, I just didn't, I don't find their packaging to be that nice. Even though the, the artwork in the front is the same artwork that they've used, they've added some sort of border around it and I don't like it. Alright, and this here is the, yes, it is the complete um, series. Includes 26 episodes on 4 DVDs. And yeah, I bought up this off eBay, so yeah. The seller's uh, description was it was like new, so I was just checking to see if it is. And you know, so far it looks good. Oh, and you know what? I think the only thing I don't like about these uh, thin pack is you know they're pretty flimsy. I think something came off of the case there. Nothing too major. All right, let's take a look at the last package here. And again, I pre-open it for you, and let's see what it is. And you know what? I this arrived pretty quickly. It is Sesame Magical Girls Club. Alright, let's open this up and have a look at it. Alright, so uh, this is Season 1 and Season 2. Um, I believe there's also the safe edition that is available. Um, I've only seen stock photo of it, but they seem to have like a sticker just taped over the the the, the, the sealed. But I didn't want to take the chance because um, I know some of them have that ugly green spine. Um, so yeah, I, I I got the regular edition instead. And what's nice about this is I've noticed that the inside here, it has the Japanese cover release. Which I much prefer over the, the English version. So 
yeah, this, um, if you don't know what it is, it's the Magical Girl series, a spin-off of Tenji Muyo. I'm trying to collect, you know, the, the complete series, so I figured that it's time to pick up this series as well. So yeah, guys, if you like uh, my video, subscribe, and I will be seeing you next time. Take care. Bye.